Hey guys, I'm Eric Creel, and this is Amphibia, Disney Television Animation, Walt Disney Animation Studios, and Ultra Lounge Fan 2002. Home of the Amphibia content, and welcome to the Disney Month of November, which yesterday I already did Disney Month of November, which is my 4K Ultra HD update. If you see from my YouTube video, click in for my channel. So, let's start from my ranking of ranking all 11 Walt Disney Animated Golden Age movies, which is best to masterpiece, which the Golden Age, Silver Age, Renaissance Age, and a Revival Age are one of my favorite ages from Walt Disney Animation Studios. So, which is leading up to Encanto coming this month, and which is for my review on Tron and Tron Legacy, including Enchanted. That might be really excited to do that. So, let's start to the number 11, shall we? Number 11, Saludos Amigos, which is a shortest movie runtime from Disney. So, but still amazing. The animation is far from classic. The characters are really awesome. The songs are spectacular. The story looks really amazing. And that's why I put this for my number 11 spot. At number 10, the Free Caballeros. Ah yes, this looks really classic. And just when you know, Legend of the Free Caballeros is on Disney XD, which is I just watched this. It looks really amazing that I yet to do a review on Legend of the Free Caballeros very soon. The story looks really amazing. The characters are awesome. The songs are incredible. The animation looks really fantastic, in my personal opinion. Number 9, Make Mine Music. Ah yes, very underrated. The story looks really awesome. The animation is very classic. The characters are amazing. The songs are awesome. And that's why I put it for my number 9. Number 8, Fun and Fancy Free. Ah yes, so amazing. The characters, we have Bongo, the bear. He looks really amazing. And for my favorite part of them all, has to be Mickey and the Beanstalk. Ah, yes. That looks incredible. The animation is really classic. The story, very amazing. The songs are very wonderful. And it is fun for the whole family. And I put that for my number eight. Number seven, Melody Time. Ah yes, very classic from the celebrity guests who sing. The story looks really amazing. The animation is so incredible. The characters are fantastic. The songs are brilliant. At number 6, The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad. This look incredible. The story is fantastic. The animation is wonderful. The characters we have Ichabod. He is amazing and including Mr. Toad. He looks awesome and the songs are really good. And I know it's not Halloween yet, not until next year, but it's over to the past months for its last month. So that's why I put the adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad for my number six spot. And now we're talking number five. Number five, Bambi. Extremely classic film. The story looks very awesome. The animation is wonderful. The characters we have Bambi. He's amazing. Fumper. He is such a cute bunny rabbit. And these are really amazing. For a Disney animated Golden Age film. The songs are wonderful. And that's why I put this is my number five spot. Number four, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. The very first Disney animated movie should be released in 1937. Very old. And the next year, it's turning 85 years. Cool. The story looks awesome. The animation is amazing. The characters, we have Snow White. She's incredibly beautiful. 
the evil queen looks so intense and amazing. The seven dwarfs are amazing. The songs are awesome. My favorite song of this movie has to be Hi-Ho. That is awesome. I put Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs for my number four. Fly Off the Sky for my number three choice, Dumbo. A very classic and timeless animated movies from Disney for over 70 years. I mean 80 years, not 70 years, 80 years. The story looks really amazing. The animation is wonderful. The characters, we have Dumbo. He's amazing. Timothy the Mouse. He's really awesome. Just like the voice of Jiminy Cricket from Pinocchio. I cannot wait to put Pinocchio for my number one. The songs are really amazing. For my favorite song has to be Baby Mine and I See the Elephant Fly. These songs are my favorites for my number three. Now time for my number two. At number two, because Matt Burnett, a.k.a. Animat's favorite movie, Fantasia. Ah, yes. Is a beautiful, animated, colorful musical event of the year is very classical and very wonderful for the music scores. These segments are incredible. The story looks awesome. The animation is wonderful. The characters are really amazing. For my favorite part of Fantasia has to be Mickey to become the Sorcerer's Apprentice. Ah uh, yes, that is awesome. Just like for my favorite part of the Cheapy Tiny Tales from Disney has to be Molly McGee to become Sorcerer's Apprentice for Halloween for its last month. Then I just watched this on Disney Channel on YouTube. And later on, Shortstober from Big City Greens. Ah yes, that looks amazing. And now time for the number one. For my number one choice has to be Pinocchio. Ah yes. This wondrous animated masterpiece came out in 1940, the exact same year as my number two spot, Fantasia, and the exact same year was Tom and Jerry. The story is amazing. The animation is spectacular. The characters we have Pinocchio. He's amazing. And for my favorite character, Jiminy Cricket. He's amazing. The songs are spectacular. Ah, yes. Really spectacular. And that's why I put Pinocchio for my number one favorite animated movie from Disney Golden Age. And tell me, what is your ranking on the Disney Golden Age animated movies? Which is your least favorite to your most favorite? For my favorite Disney animated Golden Age has to be Pinocchio. Let me know in the comments section. And stay tuned for tomorrow is my ranking all... Disney Animated Silver Age Projects. This is going to be awesome. If you want to see more videos to my YouTube channel, click subscribe, click the notification bell, whatever you like. Thanks for tuning in, and thanks for watching, and goodbye.